Hi, you guys, it's Melanie, and welcome back to Living Luxuriously for Less. I am so sorry about my absence over the past few weeks, and I wanted to make this very quick, impromptu, from the heart video to tell you guys exactly what has been going on. First off, we recently did an impromptu um, kind of a setup or a mock for a local hotel. They've chosen us to be their pre premier event designer. And we were so blessed and fortunate to uh, be afforded that opportunity. So we did some small setups for their corporate office and visitors to show what the room was capable of. Next up, I did a beautiful wedding, a micro intimate wedding for a bride. And this was her reaction when she received her bouquet. Next up, we designed an incredible yet gorgeous intimate wedding ceremony. And for those of you who are enrolled in Lux Academy, you will get all of the behind the scenes. And then I just had to steal a few moments for myself to enjoy breakfast and a quiet Sunday morning worship service virtually. I've also been working on home decor projects. I created this amazing cheetah print pillow using my Cricut Maker my Cricut Explore 3, and I do have this entire process along with my patio reveal film for you guys, and I will be sharing that with you very, very soon. I, Speaking of home decor, I've also been working on some home decor projects. This is just a very rough draft. We've done several things like extend the curtains and add some more fixtures and things of that nature, but that is the scope of the project. I've also welcomed lots of plants and green babies into our family, and so I harvested some beautiful hydrangeas to decorate for my niece's fit sixth birthday party and it turned out incredible outside of the rain and I will be doing a video for you guys um, sharing how you plan for events that are outdoors so just in case it rains so I'll be sharing those tips with you but it turned out great um, that particular week I had three events scheduled outside and it rained on all three events. It started with my niece's birthday party and it culminated with um, a corporate event. So just kind of here is <laughs> my reaction when it started raining and we ended up moving a portion of the corporate event on the inside and it turned out wonderful as well. We also dealt with tons and tons and tons of flowers. I don't know how many flowers we processed for the events that we've had this month, but it's been insane. Um, but everything turned out absolutely beautiful. We were also able to squeeze in a 60th birthday party and work with some other incredible vendors in our area. Shout out to Desire Decor Balloons. And we also did a entire lounge seating um, area. So you guys got to wait. I, I, I have all of this in the form of a video for you. Here are more flowers um, for an event that we did for a beautiful bride at the Huntsville Botanical Garden. I was so excited to do this event because her mom found me right here on YouTube. So thank you all so much for all of your continuous and unwavering support. The room that they chose was incredible. It was beautiful already. But when we added the lush, luxurious peonies and roses and black magic roses and tea roses, you guys, the event was impeccable. It was simply a 
amazing, amazing. The linens were definitely the showstoppers in, agree, um, in, in alliance with the flowers. Okay, guys, I'm going to share with you all a part of my job that I rarely share. And I always preach the fact that you need to know your every aspect of your business because you never know when you have to jump in and be in help, a helping hand. So last night, my team came in. It was like 2 or 3 o'clock in the morning. They had to unload the U-Haul um, and... You know, they, I didn't want them to try to go take it back. So I got up early this morning before service. I'm dressed for church. The car is almost on E, so I need to gas it up. And I was like, you know what? I'll just take it myself. And y'all just pick me up at the place. So I want to show you guys. I was looking for the gas pump because I don't do this. But look at what this gas pump is. So I'm looking all around the vehicle for gas. Hold on, let me show y'all where it's at. This is where the gas is. Right here in the door. A mess. Now, after pumping gas, nothing was more appropriate than a fashion show. So I wanted to just share with you guys my outfit because you're always asking what I am wearing. Plant lovers, what is this? Um and how can I fix it? I had to run in Dollar Tree to look for a couple of bud vases, but this fall oh, decor right really caught my right eye. Now. I absolutely love these golden white pumpkins. I think they would be so great for nameplate holders for like fall weddings if you put the guest names on them. And I also love these ring candles. Oh my gosh, they are so cute. And I thought they would be great for a setup. Also, the Wi-Fi um, signs were super cute as well. I think these would be great for welcoming guests into your home over the holidays. School is right around the corner, and we are also decorating a classroom for a teacher, so I can't wait to share that with you guys along with the other fall decor. And um, kind of in, on top of everything else we've been doing, we have also been transforming beautiful spaces for weddings. And so a lot of the events that I kind of showed you guys the clip of in here, I will be sharing more of in its own video. I just wanted to kind of give you guys a summary of what's been happening um, in our lives here. And it's just been crazy. It's been incredibly blessed. And I know a matter of fact, for a matter of fact, that if it wasn't for the grace of God, my team and you guys, that we would not be able to curate such beautiful events as we do today. Thank you so much and stay tuned.